Hey, welcome back to Day for Golf Instruction. Today we're going to do a product review on two different products, so a double feature. Uh, this is my assistant, my son. He wanted to be in the video, so you'll see him periodically walking back and forth. Okay, that's good. Uh, so the two feature products that we're going to feature, uh, the first one is going to be the G-Box from uh, George Ganakis, I think is how you pronounce his last name. All right, and then we are going to also pair that up with the Super Speed Golf uh, uh, sticks, all right, or speed sticks, whatever you really want to call them, all right, because I think they really go well together. So, uh, with the G Box and the Super Speed sticks, uh, I think you're really going to have a good product that you can combine together that can also help you with timing and really help you with uh, with getting some more speed, some more distance for your golf swing. Hi, make sure you like my video. Oh, you gotta see it at the camera. <laughs> see it. No. Hi. Make sure you like daddy's videos. Give us a thumbs up. <laughs> that, that was my thumb. <laughs> All right, so uh, the G-Box, which a lot of you have probably seen if you've been paying attention to YouTube videos or uh, uh, George's channel that he has out there. All right, this is a new product that he has coming out. I think a little bit of it is back ordered right now, uh, but Depending on the height is the level of difficulty. So let's just say I'll put it right around my belly button. Then you'll get two boxes and one will have a line on it. Okay, and that line, I don't really think it really matters, uh, but you're going to put it basically at your line of your shirt. All right. And then this box actually doesn't have a line, so, but I would still do it basically so it's at the seam of my shirt, okay? Uh, I've seen uh, questions out there, is this the same thing as using uh, basically an alignment rod? And to tell you the truth, it kind of is. Uh, it just decreases your chances of jabbing yourself, right? So it just gives you a little bit different opportunity to see what it feels like to have that timing. All right, so once you're all set up, the uh, little logo will go in the back, basically right on your spine. You got the boxes here on your side. Uh, this comes, I have the adult boxes. You can also buy Junior, which has a smaller waist, smaller box and stuff like that. Uh, so whatever you're looking for, basically comes in handy. It doesn't matter if you're left-handed or right-handed. All right, really what happens is you just gotta make sure you set up right. And if you uh, buy one of these boxes, there's also videos on YouTube uh, that you can watch that will really tell you more how you can use this. Maybe some of your swing falls that you have and how to use the box to help you fix it, okay? Uh, one of the big things when it comes to the golf swing, so this is just a little tip for you, is if you're hitting stuff to the right, okay, most of the time your hips are going to be in front of your hands. If you hit stuff left or you're snap hooking it, it's gonna be opposite, hands are gonna be leading your hips, all right? So what this product does is it helps you find that timing, and that's the beauty of it, is that you have to get your hands back in front of your body. So if you're somebody who hits it right and you get out here a lot or you really extend, you're going to feel it. If you're somebody who swings over the top a lot, you might get it back in front, but you're going to run into that box on your lead side, right? So this really helps you with the timing. The other thing it helps you with is it shows you where you actually are in your golf swing. So you can kind of see it when you turn. So if you don't turn at all, you're not going to feel a whole lot. And if you don't turn very much, if you turn there, you're going to hit it. All right, so it teaches you to turn your hips, how to delay your hips a little bit so your hands can get back in front of your body to help you release it. Good. All right? Yeah, so yeah. Deacon thinks it's good too. So, it's a real, I, I like the product. Basically, you took something that people were using before and you just improved it, which is what most products already do. All right, so when you take a swing, I'm not gonna go you through my swing philosophy or anything. You just should be able to swing back through without hitting the boxes. Pretty simple. Right. Now, if you move it up higher, like I said before, it just makes it harder. All right, now we're going to move this into the super speed sticks and kind of show you how those kind of migrate together and how they really should pair together well. All right, so we got the G-Box and now we have the uh, super speed sticks. All right, uh, these come in junior, these come in adult, they come in a different sizes for different heights, different strengths. 
So right now I have the adult set. Uh, it also comes with a yellow one, uh, which is the lightest. So that would be for the ladies. So it goes uh, super light, light, medium, and then red is the heaviest. All right. And if you buy these, if you go on the website, it tells you, it gives you exact sequences that you should do and how you should practice them to gain speed. I had these for about, I don't know, three or four years, uh, pretty much when they first came out. And I gained a lot of speed when I did it. Now, this is just like anything else. It's not magical. All right. So if you do this and you, let's say you gain seven miles per hour and then you don't touch them for a few months or a year, it's just like if you went to the gym and you got really strong and then you don't go to the gym for five months. You're not going to maintain that speed. You might maintain a little bit, but you're not going to maintain a great deal. All right. So when you go through the repetitions, all right, you go through the sequences, it only takes like five minutes. So it's, it's pretty simple for you to always make sure that you're doing it each day. Well, actually, you're supposed to take a day in between. All right. So do it three days a week. It takes five minutes or less each time you do it. Uh, it's really simple. You can do it in the garage, backyard, the living room. Just make sure your ceilings are high enough. All right. So today I'm just going to do it with, I would start light, then you go medium, then you go heavy. All right. So I'll just start with the light one. All right. And then when you pair it up with the G-Box, all right, not only are you working on hand speed, but you're working also on timing at the same time. So it's, that's what I really like about both of them. It's because if you get really just fast with your hands or really fast with your hips, all right, so the, the sequence that you would do is you would take five swings right-handed, five swings left-handed as fast as you could. Uh, then it goes into a step sequence, so basically like a baseball sequence. All right, and then the final one, you and this goes through each level, each color. Uh, I'll attach down below in the link uh, the website, and you can also kind of view the videos of the sequences that they want you to go through. It's super simple, all right? But when you pair these together, Right, you should be pretty simple of getting it through without hitting it. Now, when you do left-handed, that might be a little harder. So, this works really well to help make sure your hands and your hips are in time. If you do that automatically, you're going to gain more distance, right? That's why you guys on tour look like they hit it so far, because everything is in time. Most of us we look like we're trying really hard. We're trying really hard because everything's moving differently, all right? So I hope this little product review on the G-Box and the Super Speed 6 really helps you out. Uh, make sure if you haven't subscribed to our videos, uh, we'll spend time on editing these things. So subscribe, like, we need lots of likes out there.